Oh, hi. Thanks for checking in. I'm still a piece of garbage. Welcome, my name's Cookie. Or is that the first lie? No, it's not. I'm Cookie. Oh, awesome. Four-player games are the best. Don't mess this up. Let's do this. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. And everyone gets a defibrillator, which removes all but two answers on any question. Save it for a tough one. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's your first question. The National Comedy Center, a new comedy club set to open in upstate New York in 2016, has a very unique business plan. Unlike other comedy clubs, they will feature blank. Now use your device to type a lie that might fool the other players into believing it. If you get stuck for half the points, you can use the help button and get a suggestion. Do it now. Okay, now find the truth and enter it on your device. <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected.
and in the future we can expect hologram Jeff Foxworthy to be all, If your body is made of lasers, you might be a hologram. And that's it. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. A seven-year-old boy from Maryland was suspended from school for two days after biting his breakfast pastry into the shape of blank. Input your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? Nobody picked any of these other lies. Select a category. It's time for celebrity quotes of great importance. Celebrity quotes of great importance. While speaking to British magazine Hello, Black Eyed Peas' Will I Am was quoted as saying, Let's fast forward to 2060. I'll be like 90. The world is different. I don't know if there's blank. Write your lies now. Where's the truth? <laughs> okay, let's take a look. Well, don't you feel foolish? <laughs> and let's put this last one out of its misery. <laughs> now it's round two, where all point values are doubled. And don't forget to use that defibrillator if you haven't already. It's gone after round two. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Women in Japan are flocking to see Shabani. Who is Shabani? Why, he's just a blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, where's the truth? <laughs> All right.
right, let's see what everybody picked. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In 2015, baffled scientists gathered near Bergen, Norway to find out why it was raining blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Who picked what? And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked. Pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In early 2015, a man in Muskogee, Oklahoma lost his nipple when blank. Input your lies now. Okay, take a look and find the truth. Let's see what everybody selected. You couldn't have just had your nipple bitten off by a plain old horse slentered over cash. You just had to get fancy. And the rest of these lies didn't fool a soul. You're about to enter the final fibbage. Just one final question, and it's worth triple. Good luck. And now, your final fibbage question. The original name for cotton candy. Write your lies now. Okay, find the truth. Uh -oh. All right, let's see what everybody picked.
And it was also... <laughs> and believe it or not, it was also... <laughs> wow, some kind of a mind melt there. <laughs> So that's why it tastes like fairy blood. And that means some of these didn't get picked. Welcome to Earwax. I'm Mother, and I will be your host. Okay, here's the deal. You're gonna get six sound effects on your device. One of you will be the judge. The judge? Oh, how rude. Humans. Let's get to it. <laughs> Judging this round will be... What'll it be? Our prompt will be a very unpopular carnival ride. Choose those sounds wisely. A very unpopular carnival ride. Judging commences now. You're fired. The winner has been selected. The sounds chosen are... <laughs> you are rewarded one point. Congratulations! Meet the judge. Select your prompt. The prompt. How you can tell you've stayed at the orgy too long. Time to choose your sounds. How you can tell you stayed at the orgy too long.
Now loading. Judge, it's in your hands now. Now loading. <laughs> Judging is done. The winner is... Now loading. One point goes to you. Way to go. The judge is... Please select a prompt. Prompt time. Inside Paula Dean's arteries. Players select your sounds. Inside Paula Dean's arteries. First, stop the bleeding. <laughs> Judge, start judging. First, stop the bleeding. The judge has decided, and the winning sounds are... You have earned one point for yourself. You should be proud. And the judge is... Prompt time. Pick a good one. I now present the prompt. What this player would do with the Stanley Cup. Time to pick two sounds. what this player would do with the Stanley Cup. This is delicious. Hello. <laughs> Let the games begin. The best sounds have been chosen. They are... Point is yours. Enjoy it. The judge will be. Pick your prompt. Here's the prompt. How this player gets when sports are on. Select your sound, everyone.
smile this player gets when sports are on. Softer. This may take a while. Onward! A decision has been made. The chosen sounds are... Softer. This may take a while. You are now one point richer. The judge... Time to select a prompt. Your prompt is as follows. Four play in 1873. Sound selection starts now. Four play in 1873. Yes. Judge, do your thing. Yes. The judge has decided, and the winning sounds are... Yes. Alert! It is my duty to inform you that a player has emerged victorious. This is the most liked player. Way to go.
Attention agents, just a gentle reminder that falling in love with those you observe is frowned upon. Continue to pine from afar. I hear you. So I find out my wife is an mm -hmm. agent. And you had no idea? No, I was sent to spy on her. Whoa, and you have kids, right? Yeah, turns out their agents. Wow. For income. Yeah, that is pretty nice. Three, two, one. Hey, your government here. We have been kind of, sort of, collecting information about all of you. Now, before you get all angry and call your congressperson, let us make it up to you by turning it all into a game that we call... Espionage. Off we go. First up, we've collected data about everything, even this. What percentage of people have done the wave at ball games? Make it a good guess. You'll get more points the closer your guess is to the actual percentage. You're almost out of time. We have an answer. 80%. Okay, everyone else. Time to guess if the actual percentage is higher or lower. Mm -hmm. Hi, Dad. The vote is lower. Okay, let's see the right answer. 83%! I've got big points for that guess. Who said higher? No one? No one got it right? Lame. Who's next? <laughs> this one's worth mega millions. Not really. What percentage of people have spent more than $10 on lottery tickets at one time? Twenty-seven percent. Everyone pick higher or lower. says higher except for one of you. Okay, right answer is... 42%! Don't forget to play 4, 8, 15, 16, 23, and 42. Let's see who got it right. Smart, yes. Here's your points. Okay, who's up next? 
What should I search for in the old Surveillance Pro next? Ooh, I know. What percentage of people have ever put potato chips in a sandwich? Time now. Twenty four percent. What do you all think? Higher or lower? Mm -hmm. Unanimously higher. Now let's get to the right answer. Seventy percent. You weren't within thirty percent, so no points for you. Who got it right? Nice job. I've got some points for you. Next up. Most important meal of the day, folks. What percentage of people were allowed to have sugary cereals as children? Seventy-five percent. Okay, higher or lower? One lonely vote for lower. And Surveil says... 88%! Hey, you're a better guesser than our trained rats. Nice job. Let's see who got it right. Here's some points. That's it for round one. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> Round two, here we come. Who's up first? We have definitive proof here at the agency, but tell me. What percentage of people believe that there are aliens out there somewhere in the universe? Okay, we have a guess. 68%. In round two, you can now guess much higher or much lower. Pick one of those if you think the answer is off by 50% or more. If you're right, you'll earn double the money. If not, you'll get nothing. Ooh, everyone thinks it's higher. And Surveil says... 85%! That's what we call in the ballpark. Who got it right? Ooh, points for you! Who's next? <laughs> oh, here's one we've been especially interested in. Don't ask why. What percentage of people get more than half of their consumed chili from cans? Time's a wasting. 36%. All right, what do you think? Out of time. It's unanimous again. Okay, let's see the right answer. 25%. That was a respectable guess. Wow, everyone was wrong. Okay, who's up next? Hi, Dad. All right, buckle in. I've got one for you. What percentage of people have ever dressed as a Batman character? Batman, Catwoman, the Joker? 
Almost out of time. Fifty percent. What do you all think? Higher or lower? Time's running out. Just one of you is saying higher. And the correct answer is. 32%! You know, I dressed up as a bat character last Halloween. I made a great poison ivy. Let's see who got it right. Well done! You get points! Next up! Ooh, I remember seeing good surveillance for this yesterday. What percentage of women use wax more frequently than other body hair bulk removal methods? You're almost out of time. 28%. Okay, higher or lower? One person says lower, and the correct answer is... 5%! Not terrible. You get a few points at least. Who got it right? Here's some points! It's time for the final round. Through totally legal means, we found the most popular answers to this question. Which classic arcade game do people love most? Let's take a look at the board. You have three chances to pick the most popular answers on the board. Ready, go! Let's see what everyone picks. And what are the most popular answers? Let's see who's the head honcho. Congratulations, you're the most surveillance surveillance that ever surveyed.
Well, well. Looks like we're gonna have us a robot rap battle. Doors open in three, two, one. Check it out, y'all. Welcome to the battle. I'm your host for the night, Shadow Master MC, straight from the west side of Chicago. Which doesn't exist anymore. DJ Rach, tell them how the game plan is about to go down. Hey, hey, yo, don't step on that. All right, uh, I can do this. Here's how you do it. We'll ask you for a word or a phrase. That's fine, moving on. Well, Shadow? All right, I couldn't get rid of the robot, so let's do this. It's time to look at your devices. Follow each instruction that you see, and then you let them rhyme start coming off the top of your dome. Hit the suggestion button if you need help. Writing done? Cause you should. You know you can use right for me to have us fill in your line, right? Here's the draw. Check out who's facing off against who. Check it out, party people. We got the first two robot battle rappers up here, and they ready to get it in. I need my players to be sure to give props or tell them how whack they are by using your devices. I'm so strong because I eat all my eggs. You're so weak, look at those wimpy ass legs. I'm just here, to say, slowly. Your arms ain't nothing but lowly. Right. Peace and love, let's move on. Ooh, you gotta respond to that. Stealing this battle like I'm robbing a candy. Dressing up like a thing dandy. Pump up the volume, the music's sweet. Laying down the smooth as feet. Okay, all right, that's cool. All right, now it's time for you to use your devices and vote. Congratulations. I need my next two couple of MCs to step up. 
My lines are deep like an episode of Dragnet. Keep my media away from your magnet. I got a big heart, my rhymes are full of elation. I'll bring free Wi-Fi to the whole nation. Alright, alright, you heard that. Let's keep it moving. We're on deck. Let's go. Come on. My game start go charged faster than a wheelchair. My rhymes are fire. Yours are at best. If my body's limber, my brain's full of boats. Out with yo mama, sowing my oats. That was kinda cool. I know you could do better than that though. The battle is over. It's time for you to pick up your devices and vote. Congratulations. That's what I'm talking about, y'all. Good job. Now let's check out the scoreboard. All right, it's time to get right. Okay, you're about halfway through your writing time. You can use right for me to have us fill in your line. Yo, Here's on the card and main event for round two. Better get some of that money. First battle, let's get it going. movie, you'd be Jaws. But I'm motherfucking Roy Scheider. That's your music. I thought it was a lawnmower. My rhymes are smooth like a glass blower. Yo, time's away. Let's keep it moving. Yo, where the next bot at? Get your gears in gear. I don't got pity, but I can give you a walking cane. Just wait for the dopeness of the next refrain. You've gone down though you used to be funkalicious. But nowadays you're straight up ridiculous. Thank y'all. Let's keep moving. Ding ding, the bell has rang. Vote to see who was the dopest MC. We got your winner. Uh, hey, man, come on, watch where you step. Next match, 
Next battle. Try to keep up. Do you need a trike? I'll go on right now and drop this mic. When cooking up rhymes I add some edamame. I'll salt it with the tears you wet for your mommy. That was okay. Wasn't the best I heard, but it wasn't the worst either. You gotta get back to that one. You call yourself a pro. You can't even cooking. Grammar? Who cares? You ain't even booking. I drive a Bentley. You drive a corn dog. Wearing my Gucci. Going out whole hog. Right. I see this lad. Time to pick somebody to vote for. Let's get those votes in. Congratulations, Shorty. That was pretty decent. Good job. All right, y'all. That's the end of round two. Now let's check out the numbers. Let's see who winning this right now. All right, now this your last chance. Go ahead and get at them. Let them know what the real is. About a minute left, think in type. Remember to use that right for me button if you're coming up blank. Put a little pepper on it. And here are the final matchups. That main event is going to be vicious. You ready? You ready to get at them? Then come on, let's hit that. What's that? You got a frog in your knee? Swinging outside underneath your girl's tree. I'm hunting for trophies but you're just a ring. Good for some fun but not for some bling. That's okay, now let's keep it moving. All right, it's your turn. Go and tell your mom that you got ruptured. Or just wait a second, cause she'll have heard. You look like you got caught in a volcano eruption. Blood victim straight broke fashion disruption. Okay, word, cool, that's dope. Now let's keep it moving. All right, y'all, it's voting time. Let's make it happen.
is the best of the best, y'all. Time to see who's really number one. You look like you just drank some mud. You go up against me, you gonna see blood. I'd usually expect to find you in a sewer. But here you are, you nasty ass wrongdoer. Alright, alright, thank you, thank you. Now we gotta move on. Your turn, come on down. I'm fresh and new, you're as old as gramophones. Watch your back or you'll end up a mound of bones. In professional wrestling you'd be the healthcare. Non-existent, and with few to care. Alright, thanks. Appreciate you. Okay y'all, now the battle is over. You gotta use your devices to vote. Nice job, kiddo. That was dope, but now we gotta see who won. Now you got your winner. Congratulations to the big, gigantic, robotic MC. Shadow Master is out. Ain't no room or space for this up in here. Peace. Another big old robot. For the customer who wanted a locally sourced Brazilian bean, I have a map for you. Hello, welcome to the seminar. My name is Toby and... Looks like we've got some eager beavers. Let's just get right to making some moolah. Now everybody knows the best inventions solve big problems. And to identify those big problems, we'll need to do a little market research. On your device, you're going to receive two fill-in-the-blank prompts. Type in anything at all. And voila, you've created a problem. Now your created problems get sent to the other attendees to inspire their creative masterpieces. So let's get to it.
we're halfway home. Gonna move on, time's almost up. Now look at your device. You've got somebody else's problems. Been there. Simply pick the one you want to solve. We're halfway there. Tick tock, time's running out. Fantastic, now it's time to solve that problem. That's right, this is when ideas become reality, using nothing but a pen and paper. But we ran out of paper, so you'll have to use some cocktail napkins. And remember, color is your friend. That's half your time. Okay, let's wrap those drawings up. I was just gonna say that. Okay, so now let's bring it all home. Give it a title. And a snazzy tagline. Something that makes people say, take all my money, take it right now. Let's go. We're halfway there. Quit dawdling. Time's almost up. Now, each of you will present your creation with our amazing presentation tool. Really sell yourself, too. This is no time to be shy. Exactly. Now, let's see those inventions.
Great job, everyone. Now, each of you has been given some money tokens. Give your largest chip to your favorite invention, your second largest to your second favorite, and so on. Now, let's make some money. Great! Now let's see which inventions drove people wild. You'll need to acquire $1,000 in capital to not only fund your invention, but also net yourself a $500 funding bonus. Invest in a successful invention and get double your money back. But if it fails, they keep your cash. Let's see how you did. So sad. Good job. Close, but no cigar. Okay, that's it. Okay, for the final round, let's switch it up a bit. Instead of solving different problems, you'll all tackle the same. And who should choose that final problem? How about you? Simply select the problem you want everyone to solve. No hurry, but that's half your time. Not to rush you, but the clock's a ticking. Good choice. Okay, you know what's next. Let's draw. We're halfway home. Okay, let's get a move on, folks. Time's almost over. Okay, time for titles and taglines. Okay, you should be halfway done. Tick tock, time's running out.
right? This is your last chance to impress, so don't hold anything back. Breaking. Now it's time to pick your favorites, but let's raise the stakes, shall we? We're going to give you more money to invest, but now there's a higher funding bar to clear. Good luck! <laughs> Way 
to go. So sad. Good job. There you go. That's it. Congratulations. You clearly have the gift of invention. Now for some bad news. You might have missed the print on the flyer that grants us the rights to any and all inventions created here today. Yeah, it was on the back. Sorry. But thanks for making us rich. See ya. Patently stupid, that's what they say. If you've got an idea, hey, just tell us today. I am your host, Cookie Masterson. To paraphrase my dad, I love you, son. Okay, four players. I was hoping for five, but hey, I'll take it. Oh, and if anybody else wants to join, they can get in the audience at any time. The audience gets to throw extra lies into the mix and guess the truth along with players. Let's play. This is round one, where you'll get 500 points for fooling the other players with your lies. And you'll score 1,000 for finding the truth. Select a category. First up. Due to a habit he had while roaming the halls of the White House, President Lyndon B. Johnson earned the nickname Blank Johnson. 
Now, use your device to put in a lie that you think will trick the other players into believing it. If you're stuck, for half the points, you can hit the lie for me button and get a suggestion. Do it now. Alright, now find the truth and select it on your device. I love this part. And it was also... Jinx! He turned off lights left on by his staff. Personally, I'd have gone with Electric Johnson. Choose a category. Here's the question. When singing karaoke in the Philippines, you might want to avoid the song that's resulted in at least half a dozen murders. Otherwise, you could be the latest victim of the blank killings. Okay, enter your lies. Hurry, hit the live for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, seek the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? I guess Nickelback hasn't reached the Pacific Rim. Okay, pick a category. And the question is... Thought to be the result of inbreeding, the Fugate family of Troublesome Creek, Kentucky, all shared the trait of blank. Type in your lies now. Finish quick, or just hit the lie for me button. All right, find the truth. All right, let's see what you guys picked. Until that Avatar sequel comes out, they're the next best thing.
Now for round two, where the stakes are doubled. Give me a category. Now listen up. In the 17th century, Pope Clement VIII went against his advisors and declared it acceptable for Catholics to blank. Write your lies now. Hurry, use the lie for me button if you're stuck. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. All right, who picked what? Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In May 2017, a hiker in Arizona's Catalina Mountains stopped an aggressive mountain lion from attacking by simply blank. All right, type in your lies. Okay, which one's the truth? Let's see how things shook out. Mountain lions can be scared off by making eye contact, kind of like me on a date. How about some Russian fibbage? Russian's way of saying so close and yet so far translates to your blank is close, but you can't bite it. Enter your lies now. Okay, look for the truth and pick it. And what did people pick? It's final fibbage time. Pay attention, because this last one's worth triple points. Have fun. The best Spider-Man villains never make it to the movies, like the evil Fritz von Meyer, who is a blank made of blank. All right, type in your lies.
All right, where's the truth? Let's see what everybody selected. Talk about a PR nightmare for bees. Yellow. Hello? Hello. Doodle Valley. We're the small town with the big heart. We don't know whose it was, but it's buried in the mayor's backyard. Thank you all for volunteering or reluctantly agreeing to participate in our town beautification initiative. Remember, non-volunteers can still make a difference by joining the audience. The mayor wants to turn all the drab white walls in the town into colorful community art projects. Isn't that right, Mr. Mayor? That's right, Amanda. That's not my name, sir. And I know just where to start. Right here. As you can see, this piece has already been started. The city council was supposed to agree on what to paint, but this is as far as they got before their 11-month recess. Didn't finish the drawing. Where's your follow-through, pal? We believe in a little thing called democracy around here. So I'll let two of you make additions to the drawing, and your fellow volunteers will vote on who made it better. Oh, and I'm keeping you on a short timer to make sure you don't overthink it. Okay, volunteers. Ready, still ready, and ready. I mean, go. While our artists work, the rest of you can express your feelings about each drawing with the buttons on your device. I like the vegetable one. Time's running out. Finish up quick. I never thought I'd say it, but I'm an undecided voter. You all are going to have to decide which one of these is better. Come on, vote, why don't you? Okay, count them up. 
We've got our results. Not so fast, Mary Beth. Each match, I'll choose a different emoticon, and I'll give out a bonus to the drawing that earned the most of them. Um, this time, the bonus goes to the drawing with the most hearts. The people have spoken. Okay, let's see what you two can do. Go. It's voting time. Here we go. This time, the bonus goes to the most confusing drawing, which to me is all of them. Wonderful. Now you two get to add something. Let's keep the civic pride rolling. Go! away! Are you feeling what I'm feeling? I think our piece is done. Now all it needs is a title. Type one in using your device. Okay, vote for your favorite. The hard work's done. Let's step back and admire our work. Look at that! I sure am glad we made this a volunteer project instead of, you know, paying anyone. I love it! Let's take this community spirit to a new part of town. Let's see. Here. Got a good feeling about this one. Go. Time's running out. Hurry up and finish. Rack up those votes. Next up.
That shook out. Next on deck, go. Voting time. Let's count those votes. Uh, yeah, I think we're ready for a title. Pick your favorite and vote. Buckle up, here comes the final piece. I wonder if we should have started with a smaller surface. It's beautiful. What now, Mr. Mayor? Oh, I've got a special treat for our budding artist, Mrs. Vanderstein. That's not... Fine. What is it? You all have done so well, I want to commission you to do a portrait to hang in the town hall. Everybody brace yourselves, because you're all drawing at once this time. I want you to draw the alien being that abducted me last night. Sir, I don't think now is the time for this. Ah, you think I'm crazy, huh? Then how do you explain this photo I took? So I was taking my nightly constitutional, you know, to get my insides moving a little bit. And then I saw this thing that landed right in the middle of the I'm pretty sure road. he got into the NyQuil again, but let's humor him and draw an alien. Why don't you start by drawing was, some eyes? So many good choices here. Let's vote on whose is best. Next, draw an alien nose, whatever that is. Okay, vote. The 
This thing is just too disturbing with no mouth. Let's draw one. Vote. Finally, finish off this drawing with anything you want. And I mean anything. Last vote. Let's cherish this. Oh no, a tie. We're all doomed. Now, now, Thelma Lou, as mayor, I get to break all the ties. I pick this one. Prepare to be blown away. <laughs> they should have sent a poet. After a beautiful artistic experience like that, does it even really matter who the winner was? Oh, it oh it does? Okay then. Civic Doodle, Civic Doodle, just find a blank wall cause we're gonna have a ball once you start to play this game. Civic Doodle, three piece suitle, but I'm tying a vest cause you gotta look your best if you're gonna doodle with me. Oh, come to Doodle Valley, it's a place that you'll Show no restraint and try to draw a better thing than the other person who's doodling it right next to you. <laughs> 